Weapon ergonomics. Use weapon energy, guns, and melee weapons wisely in order to allocate your resources efficiently. Okay, I'd rather not use my shoddy if I don't have to. Oh, Some heels. I type of broke, so I spent three kidney. Oh, geez, that sucks. Two gigs of RAM, twenty-four, four, four eight. Oh, a forty-eight is nice. Trying to repair it. Play it safe here. I'm just getting started. Okay, I killed it. Okay, so I need this to build up power. I don't know how well this is going to work for my melee. So that just goes back to the other side. Zip line looks like over there. There 
go. Okay, a shortcut through there. Zip line. Back up there. playing this music. No idea. I gotta swim in that stuff, huh? Flamer over there. Got a lock. I know you're here, Petrov. You've got nowhere to run. I'll give you ten seconds to surrender. Oh, that's in the corner. But what killed him? Biometric readings. This is Patrol. It is? Crispy critters. Shit. It really is Petrov. Ah, I had a feeling it'd end this way. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Wizard here. Have you found Petrov, my boy? I found his body. He's been decapitated. A loader turned his skull into blood pudding. Damn. His head contained codes I would have used to end this nightmare quickly. I'm sorry, Dr. Sechenov. I was too late. <sighs> then we'll have to solve the problem another way. Did he have any rings on him? Two gold rings? Uh, no rings, sir. Just a candle. Understood. I need you to report to the VDNH at once, B3. We've got bigger problems than Petrov to deal with. What could be worse than Petrov? Stockhausen will debrief you at the VDNH. Hurry. Time is of the essence. Do I make myself clear, my boy? 10-4, wizard. Moving out. So it looks like maybe I can climb or get right up against there. They're not going to hit me. Or against the wall. Okay.
I don't even know if I need this candle. I'm just carrying it. I need another one. Put one up here, and I don't remember where I put the other one. I can just grab it from here. Yeah. Like I'm waiting to fight a boss or something. Error. Internal PEC or power generator microclimate readings are suboptimal. Electricity generation not possible. Got a canister. The energy from the candles isn't sufficient to power the main gate, but installing them. Activated a system that provides special polymers to the birch tree life support system. The life support system has four primary functions. Maintaining optimal temperature, eliminating insects. In other words, four columns, four canisters. A lot going down there, whatever it is. Charles, I'm in the hot shop. Am I gonna turn into a crispy critter if I stay in here too long? No, the laboratory tables in the hot workshop or thermarium require high temperatures, but the temperature within the shop itself is quite comfortable. Anything else over here I need? Jumping down there. Ah, it's hot as balls in here. You call this comfortable? The temperature in the shop seems to have risen to an extremely high level. Ah, no shit. The heaters must have malfunctioned. The workshop will remain filled with superheated air as long as they remain as they are. Got it. They must be in a room somewhere around here. What am I stuck on? Let's just continue to go down. Okay, we got a robot down there.
another one over there it looks like ah the boilers look like they're about to blow what the hell are we supposed to do i have no data i've never been here before <sighs> okay i'll deal with it too hot to touch. I need to find a way to cool it off from the inside. I've seen that stuff before. It's cryogenic, right? Indeed it is. That is a Fahrenheit, a candle filled with cryopolymer. It's designed to reduce temperatures and equalize pressure in high temperature furnaces. I'll try getting them into the boilers. Too bad. These aren't too hard to kill compared to the others I'm fighting. Okay, I found the opening. How do I get into the pipe? Pull one of them off? I don't know. Uh, what do I do now? Lug this shit to the boiler myself? Call seeing any other ones. Oh, another one in there. Throw that at all, okay. Something's not right. This is not like sucking anything out. Wait, oh. the pipe I can throw it in. that way. Oh, oh am I going to get that in there? Oh, the game, lo uh, the game looks fantastic. Yeah, that. 
So is there a way to turn these? Alright, let's go to this way. Must be cooling it off because I can't do anything else with it. I don't think it's gonna work. I can't get another one in there. Probably. Oh, wait, wait. Did I see something? Oh, there we go. It worked. Two more left. Gee, are you sure? Oh, God. Hi. Playing uh, oh, the new season Z3. I haven't played that in a long, quite a while. It's a good thing the pipes openings in the next room and not over by the birch tree. Okay, so. Heating up, where are we gonna? Okay. 
I think I threw one in here. Who the hell came up with all this shit? I'm <laughs> sick to death of shoving balls into tubes. We're doing this so we can leave the Vavilov complex. Why can't I just, I don't know, walk out a regular door? I'm afraid only an irregular door is available. But sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. Irritating. So we're gonna have another more. Oh god, I can't see. Oh shit. I got him stuck! Irritating. I went to legs the other. Okay. I don't try not to use my shoddy shells, but geez. Yeah, so I have to go up the stairs. Let's get her axe back out. Comrade Major. Yes. Got something constructive to say? Have I done something to offend you? Why are you taking your frustration out on me? <sighs> Sorry. It's not your fault. I'm just mad at myself. Why? You didn't kill Petrov. He was killed by his own weapon. A hostile robot. That doesn't matter. I was supposed to take him alive, and I failed. And that's not all. Sechenov saved my life. He's like a father to me. As far as I can remember, anyway, I let him down. How much of your life do you remember, Comrade Major? Uh, two years, maybe a little more. I can't remember much from before I got hurt, but as I said, he's like a father to me. If there's anything I'm sure about, it's that. Fair enough. But it's illogical to berate yourself for something that isn't your fault. Who cares if it's logical or not? Dr. Sechenov was counting on me, and I let him down. Now he's disappointed in me. And I feel like shit. If that's what's troubling you, just let it go. There's nothing unusual about your situation. What do you mean? Isn't hey, it King, obvious? how are you doing? Comrade Sechenov is always disappointed in everyone. There's no pleasing the man. His perfectionism is pathological, and everyone knows it. Every single person in his life lets him down. What? Nah, that's bullshit. Neuropolymer gloves are incapable of deception. Uh, yeah. I guess so. Done? Please select the desired procedure. Um, let's see if we can do anything for ourselves. <laughs> 